Abraham was the father of faith. Oh, Abraham blesses his mind. I am blessed in the morning. I am blessed in the afternoon. I am blessed in the night. Abraham blessings are mine. Okay. Do you think that Abraham obtained that title just by just um, um, knowing God? There was something that happened. There was something that made the Bible called Abraham or recorded that Abraham was a father of faith. There was a lot of sacrifices that Abraham made. There was a lot of things that Abraham did for the sake of God. Abraham gave his all. Abraham understood God beyond every other presence around him there. Abraham knew that faithful is he who called him who will also do it. And that was why for one day, Abraham didn't doubt God. Abraham believed God more than himself. And he was called the father of faith. Today, people talk and say, oh, Abraham was the father of faith. Or say the father of faith. Abraham is this. Abraham is that. And I asked a question. What stops you from being like Abraham? We only, only time we claim Abraham's issue is during blessings. You see people say, oh, Abraham, Abraham blessings are mine. Abraham blessings are mine. What about Abraham obedience? What about Abraham's sacrifice? What about Abraham's Total surrender to God. Abraham served God with all, with all his mind, with everything that was within me, within him. There was nothing that was left out. There was nothing that was within him that he didn't surrender to God with. He gave God his all. And that is why we are still talking about Abraham till today. Abraham loved God with all his heart, with all his life, with all his spirit, with all his soul. He didn't give God some and left some. He didn't say, God, take part of me. Let me keep part of myself too. He didn't say, God, take part of my, my, my sacrifice. Let me give part of it to myself. He gave all to God. And I asked you a question. Will you be able to give God your all? Can you give God your all without reserving some? Can you surrender your totality to him without saying, God, you know now, when I give you all, it's too much. How now do I succeed? How now do I survive? If I give you all, what happens to me? No, God, you have to take half. Let me take half. Have you given God your all? Are you, are, you, are you ready to give God your all? Do you have the mind of giving God your all? I pray for you that God will give you the grace to give him your all. In the name of Jesus. Amen.